thing I like most, Mark, is the enormous trust you have in kids nowadays. You trust these kids, and that makes it so, so mind-boggling for me. I teach in the old system. I can see its benefits as well. I know it has a lots, lots of shortcomings. It's really a, a lot to comprehend. This is so much. The current teachers are not ready yet. You were born too early, I think. That's the real reason why it scares me. Because I think I still like to believe I'm relevant in the classroom. And I still, I still believe, I think, Mark, that without me standing in front of that classroom, it's going to be a mess. I really believe it. And you don't believe it. You trust these kids. And that makes it so, so mind-boggling. Well, I recommend everybody to read it. And I'm sure there's many things that we as teachers don't agree with, especially when you say, I, I don't care what you study. You just connect these kids to the rest of the world, to, to what's relevant for them. That's, that's really shocking. To reflect on the way we think about kids. I think that's the most important message. The way we think about kids, about their abilities. Because in this system, we think we have to prepare these kids for 22 years or more, and then they will be capable of changing the world. Just make sure to read the book and, and disagree with Mark. His email is on the back. Please disagree and just tell me how to do, tell him how to do better because uh, Mark listens and he's really um, accessible. Uh, so um, even if you don't agree, I think it's a perfect opportunity to talk about education. Let's talk about it, how to improve it or how to get rid of it or whatever. But let's have a discussion and not be complacent and be within the four walls of a classroom and thinking, we are irreplaceable and, and super relevant to, to these kids. Let's, let's step back for a second and let's think about education. So even if we don't agree, let's just step back, read the book and have a discussion. Mark, thank you for writing the book.